we experience new, new things uh, all the time. This is my first ever time to be in a big screen like this. Uh, and also the first time to read my Bible text from <laughs> this little machine. Thank God that these are available today. I will read uh, to us a portion from uh, St. Mark's Gospel, chapter 15, uh, verses 1 to 15, from the New International Version. Very early in the morning, the chief priests The chief priests with the elders, the teachers of the law, and the whole Sanhedrin made their plans. So they bound Jesus, led him away, and handed him over to Pilate. Are you the king of the Jews? asked Pilate. You have said so, Jesus replied. The chief priests accused him of many things. So again Pilate asked him, Aren't you going to answer? See how many things they are accusing you of? But Jesus still made no reply, and Pilate was amazed. Now, it was the custom of the festival uh, to release a prisoner from the people's, uh, uh, whom the people re requested. A man called Barabbas uh, was in prison with uh, the insurrectionists who had uh, committed murder in the uprising. The crowd came up and asked Pilate to do for them what he usually did. So, you want me to release to you the king of the Jews? Asked Pilate, knowing it was out of self-interest that the chief priests had handed Jesus over to him. But the chief priests stirred up the crowd to have Pilate released Barabbas instead. What shall I do then with the one you call the king of the Jews? Pilate answered them, crucify him, they shouted. Why, what crime has he committed, asked Pilate. But they shouted all the louder, Crucify him. Wanting to satisfy the crowd, Pilate released Barabbas to them. He had Jesus flogged and handed him over to be crucified. This is the word of the Lord. When I was asked to give a short meditation, my mind was already thinking about uh, uh, what is happening around us. I was thinking of choices, uh, I was thinking of decisions, and uh, when James asked me, what would be your theme, I said, well, uh, decisions. Because uh, the text that I have read is a text that, uh, that challenges us to make decisions at the right time, in difficult situations. Pilate asked uh, the chief priests or the Jewish people, what shall I do? <coughs> with this man called Jesus. You know, after having uh, gone through or walked through the, the roads of Jerusalem from Mount Olive, you know, just a few days before, here were the people, uh, some commentator says, the same people who were shouting Hosanna, here comes our king, 
Zana to our king. And this, this was the same people that were shouting again today or in, in this text, crucify him. <coughs> because the thought that they had was uh, that uh, this is the Jesus that they, or the Messiah that they were waiting for, a Messiah that would uh, uh, conquer Rome. But they were wrong, and therefore they were angry, and uh, they shouted the loud, crucify him. He has misled us. We thought that he was that king who was to come. But Jesus had taught, had lived a very different type of messiahship. He chose humility. He chose serving others. He chose helping the poor. And that was the choice of Jesus. And when uh, the people there were asked uh, of their choice between Barabbas, between the, a murderer, between a killer and a thief, and Jesus, they chose Barabbas. This year, my Christian friends, this year is a year of decision. Of Fiji. Who is our choice? As a nation, come September 17. This year, within the Methodist Church, we are doing all sorts of things. We are hoping that we will choose the right path to follow. Dealing with connectional plans, our corporate plan, and all that. And there are many other ways of using this word decision and choices this year. My hope, my friends, as we think of this film of Jesus, the choices that he had to make. I believe he made deliberate choices to enable you and I to be free, to be uplifted, be empowered in whatever ways we do things. And I believe that is the message, the gospel message. We in the Methodist Church are celebrating our 50th anniversary, the golden jubilee, a time when we try and free, or when the Israelites try and free debts and all this decision. What are we going to do about those who, who have difficulties with us? A year of decision, I believe, should help us. And this film today should help us to try and uh, think seriously of the choices that Jesus made for you and I, helping us, empowering us giving us another chance to move on in life. Let us pray. God, our Heavenly Father, we thank you that you have uh, brought us together to watch the film that uh, was made or prepared by people who would like to portray you in the way that you would experience the world 2,000 years ago. Help us as we ponder on the words and all that will take place in the film to think of our choices. Help us to choose the right path help Fiji to choose the right path so that we may be enabled to hear you more and to challenge the difficulties that are with us. For the God, this is our prayer. Bless this evening together that we are having. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
ね。